offered a dock phosphate saloon in Dry Rock Gulch to purchase an ice cold Nuka Cola Wild. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Fallout 4. Apparently I've got a comment here, hang on. Let me have a look at it. Uh, memories were that he murdered the mayor of Far Harbour and placed it with the The Institute is evil, but you could have ended the eight children of Adam without firing a shot. Or convinced him that the original Mr. guy is coming back Sheriff and he leaves them well. One eyed Ike and Doc Phosphate are all the radiation because maybe the they're. Dry rock gulch. They too are sense, and the only ones actually human are the ones whose hair is falling out, like the one that the leader has you investigate. She looks sick. Anyway, I like the outcome. Kasumi comes home, and she is not a synth. That is for sure. Due to a mix there we go. I've given that person a like and a favourite. Apple juice will not be served this evening at the four. Cheers for the comment. I am used. Appreciate it. Anywho. Today, we are taking over, or rather securing, the Nuka-Cola bottling plant. Um, right, Piper. Oddwood. Hello, dead gator claw. That now has no head. I apologise. Hmm. <whistles> Oh, it's a wheel. I thought it was a nest. Well, I mean, if you're gonna just leave a stim pack laying around, it's not like I've got 172 of the fucking things. Come on, Piper. I mean, it's not like you're carrying much. I'm carrying 2,746 weights. Hey. How much are you carrying? Not a lot, really. <laughs> Come on! I'm pack-muling the shit out of this, and you've got no excuse. If you can't keep up me, with me while I've got this much weight on me, then, you know, maybe we need to uh, talk about things. Right, which way's the way in? This way, I think. Fever blossom. I'm a feeling good. Apologize for the dog barking. She's going a bit mad today. A wave of your hand. Onward, the world of refreshment. I need to clear the interior and the exterior. Right, we've got the mission. Whoop. Is there a safe way across here? I mean, you could just do that, Piper. <laughs> Why the fuck not? I'd rather not get any rads if possible. Is this even rad water? Hey, folks, oh, yeah, definitely. No, Don't drink actually, the water, Piper. This time it's more addressing some rumors than anything else. Ooh -wee. The water is definitely bad for you. Cheers for the like, whoever that was. Appreciate it. Wait, why is the stream paused? I must have accidentally hit the pause button. Mm. Come on, stream, catch up. There we go. Why is it paused again? I'm sure many of you have heard tales. Well, the group to right, mate. I'm going to turn you off to for the a Nuka Cola World of Refreshment, now featuring a river of Nuka Cola Quantum. Uh, wait, did I get a buff out of drinking it?
Uh, not doing bad on them, to be honest with you. I could do all this some better luck. That's pretty crap. Uh, these were all from perks and things. Oh, far help a survivalist. Gained five to all resistances. Yeah. For speech challenges and discover new locations. Oh, and discovering new locations. See, I knew there was a reason I liked her. Gift of Gab. Gun nut. Hacker Island Almanac 2. Oh, okay. Uh, medic, obviously. Mr. Sandman. Ninja. Rifleman. 25% combat knife and switchblade damage. Not bad. Speech challenge success. Take advantage of advanced technology. Oh, we could do with upgrading those at some point. I got scrapper. I could do with getting the last one of that. No, it doesn't look like we got any boost from that. Have we got anything that can remove rad so I don't have to waste this rad away? Have we got any thingy, what's it called? The mutant hound, cooked mutant hound. Do, 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 do. Minus in the red section would be nice. I could use one of those, but that would be a bit of a waste. New car cola. Oh, it's so many different flavors of Nuka Cola, it's unreal. I've really got nothing that removes rads other than that fucking special shit. And right away. I've got that, but I don't really want to waste that. It's going to be pretty handy. Uh... No, don't have anything that removes rads. Nuka-Cola Quantum. Twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates, twice the caffeine, and twice the taste. And just look at that amazing patented blue glow. What the fuck is going on with these hitboxes? Jesus Christ. Now who wants to kill me? Oh, that Sit back one's and good. enjoy the ride as we take you through the Nuka-Cola world of refreshment. <laughs> Nuka look. Me likey. Welcome to the Nuka Cola well, World now of the now Jesus Christ is loud in here. I, I gathered the fact that this is Nuka Cola Quantum, but it's very loud in here. Nuka Cola Quantum. Twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates. You've already said that like six times. Twice the taste. And just Where'd he go? look at that amazing patented blue glow. Yeah, that that's a radiation. No! So sit oh, back and sick. enjoy the ride My bad. as we take you through the Nuka Cola world of Oh yeah, you can't get anything out of these little fuckers. There's a bunch of dead people here. Hey dead guy. Hey dead girl. I'm Welcome assuming. to the Nuka Cola or the other way around. world of refreshment. Now featuring a river of Nuka Cola Quantum. Uh huh. Nuka Cola began its journey in the year 2042. Brad Burton. We know that wanker. We read Burton about him the other day. Was a budding chemist. Was he? Was he really a chemist? How do you know? You're just a voice in the wall. He dreamt of a delicious soft drink that would provide energy, focus, and 120% of the recommended daily value of sugar. Oh, that's an actually working thing. Uh, buff jet. Nuka-Cola began its journey in the year 2042. Oh, you can make jet out of fertilizer. Brad Burton was a budding chemist. Asbestos, carrot, and mentads. Not bad. Psycho jet. Of a delicious soft drink that would Damage resistance. Energy, focus, That's the stuff we want. Daily value of sugar. Uh, jet fuel. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have wasted all the jet. I don't really want fireworks. 
75% RAM resistance for 10 minutes. That would provide energy, Not bad. Focus, Let's make a couple of them. Of the oh, we can make the refreshing beverage sugar. now. Ooh, that's quite expensive. Nuka-Cola began its journey in the year 2042 when our fat sure, monster will add to what we've already got. Caleb Brad Burton was a budding chemist. Mines. Oh, I need demolition expert. He dreamt of a delicious sludge. sludge. That would no, that sounds like energy, fun. Focus and 120% of the recommended daily value Actually, regeneration increased. Increased with your. Oh no! Yeah, no. Fuck that shit. Traps. It would be nice to make some traps. Journey in the year 2042, when our founder John and Caleb Blacksmith Bradburton work. was a budding chemist. Mm, sure, let's make one. He dreamt of a delicious soft drink no, that would provide energy, focus, and 120% of the recommended daily value. Of well, hear you say that one more time, woman. I'm probably going to go insane. Please tell me I can turn her off. Sugar. Sweet. Nuka Cola. Can we go any further along? In the year 2042, when our founder, John oh, yeah, Caleb Bradburton, was a budding chemist. Oh, shut up about your damn chemist. No one gives two shits. Mom and Dad, are you ready for a delicious soft drink that would provide energy, focus, and ice-cold nuka cola? Where's that go? Nuka cola began its journey in the year 2042 when our founder, John Caleb Bradford. Sorry, Robo Ding Dong. He you fell down the stairs. I kind of want to check out the lower floors before I go up there. Twice the caffeine and twice the taste. And oh, peace and quiet while I'm opening a lock. Don't have to listen to this damn nut job. Can I get in here, please? That'd be great. Thanks. Just look at That's that it. amazing patented blue glow. 35% alcohol by volume. A Nucola Hunter. Do not consume Nucola Dark if you're pregnant or planning on becoming pregnant. Oh, Do at not least operate motor vehicles or heavy machinery for at least eight hours after drinking. Uh, okay then. Hey mom and dad, are you ready for a night out on the town? I'd much prefer it if you then stopped talking. Then pick up an ice-cold Nuka-Cola Dark and experience the most thirst-quenching way to unwind. Where's this damn speaker? I'm gonna blow it up. 35% alcohol by volume. Do not consume Nuka-Cola Dark if you're pregnant or planning on becoming pregnant. Oh. Do not okay. operate motor vehicles or heavy machinery for at least eight hours after drinking. Wait. Hey, Mom and Dad, are you ready for a night out on the But this isn't just a ride. It's one of several operational factories actively producing Nuka Cola. The most thirst quenching way to unwind. Hell yeah. You're gonna let me in there, but I'm gonna leave. Area, we combine just 35% alcohol by size. Team select root flavors to produce the Wait. Do not consume Nuka Cola Dark if you're pregnant or planning on becoming pregnant. Oh, it's a different tunnel. Do not operate motor vehicles or heavy machinery for at least eight hours after drinking. Nuka Cola. Well, we'll check out the bottom bit later. I want to do the, like the medium area first, and the, like the top and bot uh, medium. Then we'll do the bottom. Start at the top. Work our way down. Ish. Uh-huh. I don't actually use those bullets, but I'll take them anyway, I guess. It's not like I'm severely over-encumbered and I don't really give a fuck about what I'm picking up. 
they pick up a delicious nuka cola wild. Really? I didn't know that. Weird computer voice. I wonder how many times that woman had to fucking completely repeat that shit while recording it because she fucked up. Do not drink Nuka Cola Dark if you are pregnant or planning on being pregnant. Please do not suck an oyster out of your buttocks if you are on fire. The resulting injuries we are not liable for. While out here on the East Coast, folks delight in the refreshment of an ice cold Nuka Crate. Nuka really? Or I'd or never have Nuka guessed. Cherry. Hey, something's out there. Nah, I don't think it is, mate. I'm pretty sure I just one banged both of those turrets. This one stayed intact. That's pretty impressive. That one, not so much. It took almost two years to perfect the formula, but in late 2044, Mr. Brad Burton was finally successful at Nuka Cola with It quickly surpassed other lesser beverages to become America's number one favorite soft drink. Did it? I'd never have guessed. Not one to rest on his laurels, Mr. Brad Burton and his team of talented beverageers continued to create new and exciting formulas. <gasps> really? I'd never have guessed that. It's not like he's a fucking drink scientist. I mean, you know, and that being his job and all. Apparently that one wasn't. He did. Where'd you go? You scuttly little fuck. Owned. Nah, I'm alright, Puppy. Don't worry about it. Did you really got killed by these little fuckers? Why can't I go in there? I mean, there's a door that I want to go through. Come on, give me that damn Nuka Cola. Really? I'd never have guessed. Look, this lady's so fucking drunk she fell over. They enjoy regional favorites, such as the classic Nuka Cola Quartz and refreshingly patriotic Nuka Cola Victory. Really? Or for those that prefer a timeless root based beverage, hey, friendly guy. they pick up a delicious Nuka Cola Wild. I'm having your drink. Your drink, your outfit. Ooh, more west, eggs. They enjoy regional favorites, such as the classy Nuka Cola Quartz and refreshingly patriotic Nuka Cola Victory. Nuka Cola Victory. Ignore the. Uh, over that woman. She's very loud. Uh, no, I'm in Nuka World Quartz Plant. Well, that was another wanker I just killed. Was it this wanker? What was over this way? And be on the lookout for a special pre-release shipments of Nuka Cola Quantum coming soon to your favorite grocer or restaurant. You did. Right, so I came out of there. 
I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going, to be honest with you. They enjoy regional favorites, such as the classy Nuka Cola Quartz and refreshingly patriotic Nuka Cola Victory. How was that ice cold? It's just been sat on that bench for God knows how long. Or for those that prefer a timeless root based beverage, they pick up a delicious Nuka Cola Wild. Sure, I guess. Oh, I'm going back towards the beginning. I killed this dude here, I remember. It took almost two years to perfect the formula, but in late 2044, Mr. Brick Burton was finally successful, and Nuka Cola was born. It's, well, it's Sunday, so no. <laughs> Not a typical Saturday. Lesser beverages to become America's number one favorite soft drink. Go on. Holy shit! Nuka Cola! Mr. Brad Burton and his team of talented beverageers continue to create new and exciting formulas. Wait, are we actually heading back towards the beginning? It took almost two years to perfect the formula, but in late 2044, Mr. Brad Burton... He dreamt of a delicious soft oh, yeah, that would provide energy, focus, <laughs> and 120% of the about it. daily value of sugar. Hey, Mom and Dad, are you ready for a night out on the town? Then pick up an ice cold Nuka Cola Dark and experience. Level up! Right, what are we putting in? Let's have a look. What did I want to put it in? Reload faster could be handy. Action Boy could be handy. Uh, yeah, all right. First quenching way to unwind. We'll get Action Boy to the top and then we'll swap over and do the other one. I know. Yeah. I'm quite scientifically enlightened. Do not operate motor vehicles or have any training on the road for eight hours after trash. Pre-release shipments of Nuka Cola Quantum. Nuka Cola Quantum. Favorite grocer or restaurant. While out here on the East Coast, folks delight in the refreshment of an ice cold Nuka Grape, Nuka Orange, or Nuka Cherry. Robbed. Do you know what? I could actually go for a Nuka Orange, Nuka Cherry. One of those two. Of I actually want to know what it is like. Does it actually have radiation in it? Or is it just because it's been in a radioactive wasteland? Either way, it sounds like a fun thing to try. Oh, this leads me back this way. Right, I need to go back through. Did I go all the way to the top? Yeah, I did. I'm sure. Yeah. Of this room, anyway. Did we... Oh, we never went through that tunnel at the very top. Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Right, let's go up. This is where the robots were. Uh, considering the technology we had in the 1970s, the last 50 years, we have made fucking leaps and bounds in science. I mean, even in the last, well, in the last 20 years, we've gone from brick phones being the Nokia 3310, which is what I had when I was little, to smartphones that unlock with your thumbprint or your face print and I mean you can ask Google stuff from your phone like hello Google hey Google okay she's ignoring me now enjoy the ride as we take you through the Nuka Cola world of refreshments but I mean hey, just imagine what's going to be there in like a, a few more the years town? I mean in the nine Think of the things that they did in the 90s, like the 1960s when they went to the moon. Was it the 1960s? Just since I just saw Back to the Future. 
Yeah, but Back to the Future, we do actually have a form of hoverboard, and we do have self-tying shoes, which were... I'm pretty sure they were made by Nike, but they were to do with Marty. I can't remember the bloke that plays, his, plays Marty, but... Um, he, I think he had Parkinson's or something like that, and he partnered up with Nike, I think it was, and they've worked on self-tying shoes for people with Parkinson's, so... But in the 1960s, I think it was, was it the 60s? They sent people to the moon, and we've currently got people planning on going to live on Mars. You'd have thought they'd have tested out this idea on the moon first, but you know. Each to their own. Ah, it's alright, Piper. Free shit, you can't turn it down, we're English. Or at least I am. You might not be. Hello. Goodbye. Oh, that baby Milo was stuck on the fucking runway. I suppose it's a good exercise. It'd be like a treadmill for them. Why am I expecting like a, a nuka death claw to pop out of the fucking wall? Yeah, I reckon I've got to go down there in a minute. It's been a while since I did Nuka World, so bear with me while I try and remember everything. Doesn't seem like a great place to linger for. Ah, I wouldn't worry about it, Piper. I mean, I'm basically a god and you're my wife, so I'm pretty sure you're fine too. Wait, what? How would you react if you were an astronaut in a spaceship and you'd just seen the Earth be blown up? Well, I'd be pretty pissed off considering my favourite animals live here. I definitely want revenge on whatever blew the fucking pla planet up. That one's for, for sure. One sec. Right, I'm back. How much Whee! of this do you think still works? Uh, probably quite a bit of it, actually, Piper. Oh, there's so much to loot and so much to explore and... I'm not even joking, this entire episode is probably going to be in this place. There's a reason I saved this for last, is because if I remember correctly, this is the largest place. I know the uh, the other zone that we were in before, the g whatever the fuck it what was it called? The... This place here had a lot of inside different areas, but this is the bottling plant for fuck's sake. Oh, we don't want to go out there. Oh, I'm looking for one of those star cores in here as well. Okay, we came up this way, didn't we? Did we come up this way? I don't know if we did. Well, there's the robot I need to kill. She's now dead. I don't think we did come up this way, did we? No, we didn't. Ah, there's a couple more robots we need to kill in here. Necessarily. Um, 
Ooh. Hello there. Yeah, shoot me while you have no leg. We are all dying every second. Indeed we are. You start dying from the day you are born. Aha! I'm not reading his name because it's rather. As far as I know, last living member of Sergeant Lanier's recon team. We tried to secure the bottom of the planet. Got overrun by some new breed of Meyer lurk. I've never seen anything like them. Blue glow, so strong, stronger than any Commonwealth lurk I've encountered. It's got to be the quantum running through this place. We uh -huh. their nest. It's the core. They poured out. We fell back, but I'm pretty sure one of those damn lurks made off with my leg in the process. Private Clay dragged me to safety before I sent him to warn the others back at the camp, but... Uh, we lose three million cells every I second. I screams from here. Sounds about right. Elf's not coming. And I'll be damned if I'm gonna be food for some mile lurk spawn, so... I'm taking this matter into my own hands. This is Corporal Downey. Signing off. Uh, I can't get through that door yet because the power's off. What subject were you best at? Um. Well, it was either IT, Internet Technology. I don't know what you call it now. Uh, or sports, really. I know two very conflicting. Uh, things. <laughs> Nerd and athlete. Yep, that's me. Or was me. And now for a special surprise. This is where we produce the newest member of our family, Nuka-Cola Quantum. It's not the newest. Aha! Disprises. No. Temporal? No. Uh... S E Nope. All right. Let's try again. Alright, sentence. Zero. Mansions? One. <laughs> What's your biggest fear? Do you have one? Mm, not really. <laughs> Glow isn't just for show, but uh, defenses. Got it. Don't really have a fear. Uh, access subsystems. Need to repair. Security door? Open. I don't know which door that opened. Oops. Quantum contains a top secret additive to give you a nuclear boost. Uh, running up to the roof for a minute to see. For a minute to see, check. If this is some sort of military training exercise. Of energy. Well, there's clearly a typo on that. Any other computers now, I can access? For a special surprise. This is where no. we produce the newest member of our family, Nuka Cola Quantum. Yunk. Oh, a bunch of shit died down there. Ooh, okay. Nice. Yoink. Welcome to the Nuka Cola World of Refreshment. Now featuring a river of Nuka Cola quantum. Don't bother me. Nuka Cola quantum. Twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates, twice the I know it might affect and some people, and that's why they choose religion, but it really doesn't bother me. you just got to enjoy life while you've got it. 
And just because I'm an atheist doesn't mean that I believe no so one goes to another place. People don't. Animals do, in my eyes. They're the only ones worthy of even of receiving an afterlife. We hope you have enjoyed the ride. I know they I murder for food, but that's not their choice. We murder for pleasure, as a race. Not me personally, but... all of us at Nuka World, we hope you have enjoyed the ride and learning more about Nuka Cola. On behalf of all of us at Nuka World, we hope you have enjoyed 100%. the ride and learning more about Nuka Cola. Oh, okay. Well, Nuka Cola today is bloody of blocked us off. At Nuka World, we hope you have enjoyed the ride and learning more about Nuka Cola. Uh, well, yeah. I had. Of of well, it wasn't technically world. mine, it was my grand's. But we ended up looking after Nuka-Cola. it while I was younger for a, quite a while. Uh, we had a tortoise that you're not legally allowed to have in this country anymore. Well, it was pretty cool. I'm not sure why you're not allowed it in this country anymore. It must be something to do with its breed or something. I think it was going extinct or some shit, but that's a pretty cool thing to have. Uh, my great-gran had a marmoset monkey. The tortoise was hers as well. She found it walking down the side of the road. It was probably about fifty when she found it. He was probably just over a hundred when he, we had to have him put down because he went blind and deaf. He couldn't find his own food, even though it was Nuka-Cola on a plate in front of him, which was horrible. Twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates. He had a good long life. And twice the taste. And just look at that amazing patented blue glow. My favourite biscuit, a rich tea, mate. By far the best biscuits in the world. Here in the Second best, chamber, Bourbons. We carefully pour each delicious liquid into our new Space Age rocket bottle. Each bottle is carbonated and then sealed with one of our signature bottle caps. Oh, I opened the power armor door. Here in the bottle. Hell chamber, yeah. But this isn't just a ride. It's one of fucking taking that. Actively producing Nuka-Cola. Oh, it's all legendary. What? Plus three agility with all pieces equipped. For all of them. <laughs> Yoink. Actually, I might give this to Piper. Oh, I'm not Here losing this. Alright, well we've looted down here. I'm tempted to go and leave this by the front door so I don't lose it. So sit back and enjoy the ride as we take you through the Nuka Cola World of Refreshments. Oh, okay. We've, have we completed any of them? I never used that computer. Uh, after being on vacation for the past month, I'm sure you are all excited to be back and earning a paycheck. So let's see those smiles. We've only got a couple days before the grand reopening. I agree with Bon Bon, but Ridge Tea, they are just tasteless for me, only good with tea. Nah, rich teas are fucking amazing. I don't know what they're like in your country, but in England they are the shit. Which, I don't know if you have that saying in your country, but that is that means they are the best. Okay. Oh, they are just perfect. Um, a couple of days before evening, and the management doesn't feel like your suitability. Suitability suitably eager and enthusiastic you can be replaced don't forget you still decided fully automated for the reopening 
to buck up and ride the quantum. In fact, I've been told by the beverageers that if you're feeling a little low on energy, you can drink Hello, the quantum right out of... Oh, right. One of my best friends well, from when I was little moved to Malaysia. Uh, you can drink quantum right out of the river. The new nuclear quantum is so packed full of energy that it kills any bacteria it touches. So drink up. Free Nuka Cola. <laughs> I'd love to work here. Uh, management has decided that the Nuka Bar selection of the ride is to be automated. And the rich teas, you don't want to get the fucking like shop brand ones. You want the proper ones. Uh, where was I? Further than that is, despite numerous warnings, the actors are only to simulate drinking Nuka-Cola Dark while staffing that section of the ride. Jenny fell off the stool and into the river. She's fine, but the nurse said she had a blood alcohol level of 0 0.37 after only two hours into her shift. While we appreciate her enthusiasm for Nuka-Cola products, we also have to maintain a safe environment for our guests, one of, one of whom lost their glasses when Jenny hit her head on the boat. <laughs> I understand that some of you have come to work to for us. No, I mate, no worries. Cheers for jumping in, bud. Appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your night as well, mate. Uh, for us, amusement park of ad living was permitted or even encouraged, but here at Nuka World, we ask you stick to the script. For example, the Wild West section of the ride is to be staffed only by cowboys or cowgirls. It is not to be staffed by Nuka girls, Zaytans, clowns, knights, pirates, gorillas, ninjas, or sea monsters. Uh, it's come to our attention that a number of pranks have been played on workers in the bottling plant. Be advised that these kinds of pranks are not in keeping with the culture outlined in Nuka World Employee Handbook. For example, filling a tray of empty bottles with our dry ice and sending them into the ca uh, into the capper so they explode when sealed is clearly in violation of safety protocols. I'm sure when Randall gets out of the hospital, he'll probably say it was hilarious, but Nuka Cola is paying for his eye surgery, so management finds it less funny. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Uh, but so all we have is coffee, water, and a variety of other boring beverages. Hmm, that won't do at all. I've got an idea. Uh, Phantomeme creation of Nuka Cola. Sir, so you've done it. This is delicious, and I can feel my heart racing. That sounds like cocaine. They're all drug addicts. Burn them to the ground. Well, out here on the East Coast, folks delight in the refreshment of an ice-cold Nuka-Cola. Or, 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 or
great and horrible at the same time. <laughs> Alright, how the fuck do I get out of here? There we go. Let's take this next set of power armor home, and then we'll come back. I'm going to drop off all the crap I've collected as well, so I can run around a bit. Nuka-Cola in 2044? Alright, in 23 years, if Nuka-Cola isn't a thing, I might have a fight with someone. Alright, that's the deal. I want Nuka-Cola in 23 years, or there's going to be a fight. Jesus Christ, that's nearly as old as me. I'll be about nearly 50 by the time that comes out. And if 2077 doesn't have power armor, I'm going to be pissed, right? What <laughs> fucking power armor? Just run down the street and just punch holes in buildings. No, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> That's vandalism. I've got something a bit different for you. Let's go. <clears throat> I've got something a bit different for you. Our scouts have found a promising spot for a new settlement. Once you clear it out, set up a radio beacon to let settlers know about this it. better be that place before in... you know it we'll have a yes it is farm instead of waste finally it. we'll take back the commonwealth one piece at a time that's a lie i'm no synth who's calling you a synth the fuck Don't let who do what. Hang on. Let me go and see what the fucking problem is. Not a synth. Let him go. He's not a synth. My god. Thank you. We're good then, right? Well, okay. But I'm keeping my eye on you. Got it? Just leave him alone, will ya? Just looking to trade a little. Go ahead. Well, he is carrying a laser pistol, so maybe. Yes? Oh, wait. He's been here for ages. I just want to trade a few things. Sure. I gave him the laser pistol. Oh, you haven't got any ammo, mate. Hang on, let me sort you out. Right, you need... One of them. I want to trade a few things. Okay. You should be using your gun, mate. There you go. It's a pleasure to serve with you, sir. Oh, it's a pleasure to be served by you, robot. Whichever robot that was. Apologize for not knowing. Oh, we got our own set of new Coca-Cola armor. Whoop, whoop. I might have to do a power armor playthrough at some point. Oh, wait. Is this our second set of Nuka Cola armor? Oh no, that's Vim. Oh, we got Vim, we got Nuka Cola. Oh yeah. Right. I know Sean's bedroom is now a power armor room, but it's my house, my rules, my village. Don't fuck with me. I'm the leader of the Raider Army and the Minutemen. Right. I am basically god around here. Okay, got it? Yeah, sweet. Right, weapons. Uh, that, them, that, that. Uh, those. The commie wagon. <laughs> That's actually quite funny. Um, that. Mm, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Is that Haley? Is that rain coming in? It's just hammering it down. I don't know if you can hear that. Uh, no. 
Yes. No. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, yes. No. Oh, fuck. That was it. P. Uh, there it is. Uh, yes. Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, I'm going to say yes. Yes, yes. Uh, yes. Yes, these are great. Uh, I've not found a Chinese pistol yet. I don't know if they're in this game. I can't remember. Uh, those. Right. Armors. Uh, that, that. Uh, I need to keep hold of those. Those. All of them. Oh, it is hailing. Please tell me that wasn't my armor I just put in there. put that away in a chest somewhere. I've got a lot of legendary crap on me. Right, let's put the radio on. While I sort all my shit out. I'll just sing a bit. <laughs> You'll think of me when you God, all alone. Do, 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 do. Maybe you're one who is waiting for you. Welcome, Andrew. When, what will you do? Maybe you'll think of my side waiting about you. <coughs> maybe you'll ask for to come back again and maybe I'll say maybe Right Let's go and scrap the weapons that I don't need yeah. Hey, Mama Murphy. Uh, right. Let's scrap that. And that. And that. That's fucking hilarious. I'm keeping it. That can fuck off. That can fuck off. That can fuck off. All this pipe crap can go. 
Plasma pistol? I didn't know that had that on me. That. 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 I think that's it all. Right. Let's go and put away need, the last two yeah. weapons. A few weapons. And then I can put away nearly 2,000 weight worth of actual junk. Come back again and the maybe I'll say maybe Right and the grenades Right I don't need that or that or that or at least twenty of them. I don't need those or those or those or those all these. Oh, I never put away my foods. The Minutemen are making waves in the Commonwealth, folks. And that's good news for all of us. The latest word uh, is that they've retaken the castle. It's an old holdout of theirs from back in the day. From everything I've heard, it was no small feat to get that back under their the, control. Travis, that happened eons ago, mate. There's some real monsters out there in the Commonwealth, folks. Now that they've set up shop, I'm told the Minutemen will be in a better position to help whoever in the Commonwealth... I mean, that is true. He's not lying. That's good to hear, don't you think? Elton Bridge is uh... up next. Hard to imagine a time when carrying a Geiger counter was a positive thing, but there you go. Uh, time to put all my Nuka Colas away as well. I need to count them at the end of the playthrough and see how many i got, because I've been collecting them. And I'm even bought me a jeep, and I can sleep. Uranium fever is gonna get me down. Uranium fever is spreading all around. On the Geiger counter in my hand, I'm gonna stick me some government land. Twenty nuka co, fifty six, fifty eight nuka colas. That's mad. I'm not even joking, I've collect more Nuka Colas while being Nuka World, which obviously is a thing. Gonna be a thing that I have the entire rest of the playthrough. Uranium fever is gonna get me down. Uranium fever is spreading all around. When I got your counter in my hand. Uranium fever is gonna get me down. Get rid of that, and them. And then that day was the bones in my back that are gone astray. Uranium fever is gone and got me down. Wow, nearly 400 weight was food. Right, let's get rid of drugs that we don't need. Uh, that, that. That, them, those, that, that could be handy. They're not useful. Mm, that could be handy. Don't really need that. Uranium fever is gonna get me down. Uranium fever is spreading all around. Wait, so that means literally like a th at least, at least a thousand five hundred weight is just junk. Fucking Jesus. Why am I carrying this so heavy? Rocket 69. Oh, probably misc stuff that I can't use as junk. Name that like you and I have such a wonderful time. Wait. Oh, yep. Seven weight there. Oh, six weight there. Rocket sixty nine, rocket sixty nine, and now I'm taking them. 
Got me so satisfied. Sixty nine. Oh, didn't know I had those on me. Right, Piper, let's grab me caps and I am bouncing take back to Nuka time. World. We'll take you. Doot, doot. Yoink. You. Right, back to Nuka World. Actually, we need to empty Piper. Where is she? Oh, there you are. Hey. Shoot. Doot, hey. Doot. Junk. <laughs> Where to? Right, so how much weight did you have on you? Oh, like 120. Is that all you can carry? Oh, I suppose you are carrying your armor as well. We'll rip it, we'll dip it. We'll rip it, we'll dip it. We'll ride and go and be so satisfied. I'm a rocket sixty nine. Mm -hmm. Oh, the Grim Reaper's sprint perk. Ooh. <laughs> Do you know what? I'd actually love to own some of these pins. I might have to find out if you can actually buy them. Because they'd be pretty cool. Just attach them all to a, a Fallout 4 t-shirt or jumper and just hang them in one of those. You know, do you know those uh, like picture frames that people put like baseball jerseys that have been signed or whatever in? You get one of those. Just slap the new um, Fallout 4 jumper or t-shirt in there with all these pins on that look fucking awesome I'm, I really want to do that now even if I have to make the fucking frame myself which won't be too hard wood is pretty much my specialty wait what Oh, I've only been in the world of refreshments. I've not actually been in there. Oh, I need to go and claim me overhaul thing. Well, we're going to collect that and then we'll go to where we need to go. <laughs> it's probably going to make me over encumbered just going to collect this shit. <laughs> mighty mighty man, I heard the news. Come on, game, you can manage. Oh, it's not raining now, so I can open the window again. Right, I need me loot. Where is it? Oh, it's nice to be able to actually run again for a change. Yoink! Oh, shacking up already, are you? Ain't no one sad about Coulter. Just don't screw this up. Hi. If you're wearing a collar, it's because you asked for it. Ain't no one's a slave that don't want to be. The pack lets it all hang out. 
Well, I like your hat, so I'm not going to offend you. <laughs> oh, leprechaun. Feeling lucky, you should, with the four-leaf clover perk, each hit and vats as a chance to fill your critical meter. The vault boy is a fucking leprechaun is brilliant. <laughs> All right, Piper. I believe we are still needed to go in here for some reason. Okay, well, let's head back in. I need to get the power back on somehow. Welcome to the Nuka Cola World of Oh, I didn't miss that. Jesus Christ. I don't give a fuck Nuka about your Nuka Cola quantum. Where's the Jenny? Twice the caffeine and twice oh, we never went this way. And just look at that amazing patented blue glow. You'd think that might be the place is overflowing the freighters right now. Oh, this is actually the way we need to go. <laughs> now you could assume they got what they wanted and bolted. But given how creepy that place was, you can't help but wonder if something else happened. <laughs> we may never know for sure. You know what? That's okay with me. Sentimental or sappy? Here's one more tomorrow, folks. Make the call. Where do I need to go? Oh, I'm in the bottling plant now. So I just need to clear out these wankers. Do, 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 do. Well, there's definitely a lot of these wankers in there. It's a nuke alert, Queen. Piper, bail. 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 She's gonna kick shit out of us. <gasps> well, I'm only cautioned right now. There's two of them. Oh no, there's not. She's coming up. Oh, she's not even hard. What the fuck? I was expecting her to be a beast. What the fuck? Next to me. 
Considering how big the queens are, the kings are tiny. Seen one of these in ages. Nuclear protection, on a Nuclear protection on a budget. Anyone that paid for one of those things did not survive. They obviously starved to death or opened the door and died from radiation poisoning. Thanking you. Yoink. Yoink. Alright, where are all these wankers? Lay your pistol down. Lay the pistol down. Pistol back in my mind. Lay the pistol down. Pistol down, babe. Lay that pistol down. Pistol back in my mind. Lay the pistol. Down. You are not alone here. I see you. Why is it so hard to fucking hit these things? These shots just shoot straight through them. Guess we showed them. Lay that pistol down, babe. Lay that pistol down. Pistol back in my mouth. Lay that thing down before it goes up and hurts somebody. Oh, I took out my windshield and she hit me over the head. She cussed and cried and said I'd lied and wished that I was dead. Babe, lay that pistol down. Pistol back well, in my mouth. Lay that pistol down. From deep down Texas way, mm -hmm, the way we play, we're a rooting to shooting trio. Where's this wanker? In the deep teller. Found you, you prick. Why are there three queen, uh, three kings and one queen? What was that? Hit Boston or something. Revenue is came. Uh, was the start of the H. Pistol back in my mouth, lay the pistol down. What? Maybe it wasn't. I think Boston. Hang on, if it was a thing that is even worth looking at, I'd be in here. Pistol back in my mouth, lay the pistol down. Pistol back in my mouth, lay that pistol down. Hang on, what was it called? <laughs> oh, they hit Boston. I'm on the hearts and gentle people. Who live in my hometown? There we're hearts and gentle people. Would forever let you down. There we go. From Friday till Monday. They hit Boston. This is really happening. 
Um, Janie's college is out there. The hell with the excavation protocols. Evacuation protocols. I have to go find her. Raul, if you find this, sorry I couldn't stick to the buddy system. Good luck. Oh, Casey's password. Another dear hearts and gentle people loving my hometown. <laughs> The good book from Friday, Monday. The weekend goes. In love, I'll feel there one day. Right, so how do we get the power back on? I can't remember. Each time that I am blown. And dancing like a drum And now there's dear hearts And gentle people Who live and love in my hometown And dear hearts and gentle people Who live in my hometown <laughs> Up Thanks we go! Yoink! Yoink! Free power, cool. Yoink! Moin! Ah, Dicto. And that's good news. We're running low on that. The latest word is that they've retaken the castle. So we'll Up we go! From everything I've heard, it was no small feat to get that back under their control. Ah, uh, it's piss easy if I did it now. Real out there in the like two bang the bitch. Right. Now that they've set up shop, to the pack. Boo. Speak to Gage. Done my job, That's motherfuckers. Let's go and talk to Gage. Ella Fitzgerald is not, I repeat, not a woman who you want to leave hanging. Right, let's fast travel to him. How much XP did that give us? None? Apparently. I need to open my other window again. It's fucking the PlayStation's overheating. It's just so fucking hot at the moment. Ugh. Sometime today would be a nice game, if you don't mind. Not like I've got things to do. Like talk to Gage and Turn the power back on so I can go and complete that other side mission that I want to do. First you say you will and then you don't. And then you say you will, but then you won't. You're undecided now, so what are you gonna do? And when you do, and then you say you'll stay, that's when you'll go. It's undecided now, so what are you gonna do? I was wondering why it was in my base. Apparently not, he's outside. None offense. Right, Gage. I have arrived. Gage. Well, I'll be damned. You actually did it. Nuka world is ours. All of it. 
surprised. Why are you acting surprised? Hey, no disrespect, boss. You've just got to understand. We ain't ever been on ground this solid before. Now that we're here, let's keep this party going. I'm thinking it's time we set our sights on the Commonwealth. Are you crazy? Why bother with the Commonwealth? Don't we have everything we need over here? That sounds like Coulter talking, boss. Ain't a good sign. Taking back Nuka World is a big friggin' deal, no question. But it can't be the end of things. Needs to be a beginning. These bunch of savages need a goal, something to focus on. If they ain't got it, they'll wind up turning on each other. Good. An operation this big, we're gonna need more of, well, everything. Nobody's gonna hand it to us. We need to take it. Commonwealth has a ton of shitty little settlements that could be One put sec. to better use. Don't you think? Uh, are you sure that's wise? You sure that's wise? We just got this place back on its feet. Do you think it's wise to watch the gangs tear each other to pieces? Yeah. Fighting over what's left of this place? Of course you don't. So let's focus on avoiding. They're not yours. We don't gotta rush into this headlong. We take it slow. Be smart about it. If we're aiming to grab a piece of the Commonwealth, it's going to take the right contacts and a lot of muscle. Right? I say we go have ourselves a chat with Shank. He's the point man for everything entering and leaving Nuka World. He floated this idea before. Been itching to talk to you ever since. You I want to get the over. power on. I don't give so a I fuck bet about this. A good idea of where to start. He's mm -hmm. in charge of the caravan, so odds are you can find him somewhere near the marketplace. You trust this guy? You trust this Shank guy? You ought to know by now. I don't trust anyone, but Shank's on the level. I got no reason to think he'd screw us, especially if he stands to profit as much as anyone. Uh, if you're vouching for this Shank guy, that sounds good enough to me. Yeah, sure. How else do you think he ended up at the top of my Christmas list? Just head over and talk to the guy. He'll back up what I'm saying about the Commonwealth. And while you're doing that, I've already got the gangs working on getting Nuka World's power plant up and running. It's about time we shed some real light around here and let people know we mean serious business. Oh. And if you want my advice, or if you want me to tag along, you've got it. What's that? Just a message. Uh, I want to get the power on. I don't give a fuck about the rest of this. I just sure, want to get the power on so I can go and complete the other mission. It's not fun unless you're Why the fuck? Fuck is what? Oh, I need to go and collect that fucking. Yeah, we'll go and collect that. Then we'll go and talk to him. Right, cat. If you want your rest, some of your biscuits, you're gonna have to wait a minute while I fill up your pot. Some more of your biscuits. Make your geese. Anything goes. How long you think it's going to take us to drink that whole river of water? Come on. Carry something before you. Right. The only other one we've got is here. Yourself. <laughs> you got the news when you got <laughs> Oh. 
Right. We need to actually hey, be outside hey. here. Hi. Well, well. It's the highest and mightiest himself. How can I be of service, eh? What you got? What have you got? The medicine you need to set yourself free. I've got chems of all kinds for you, boss. Just tell me what you need. Um, Let's joke. see what you got. My pleasure. Well, I actually need to show you some shit. We need pipe weapons. Cool. No, we don't. Fuck. Right, you've got what's in your bowl. If you don't want it, Kino, that's it. That's all I can give you. Oh, you've had your dinner for today. Bunch of chems in this one. <laughs> Where'd you go? You cheeky shit. They're not your biscuits. Do you want yours in the window? You do. Alright then. What do they do, darling? There he is. Well, oh, it's this guy. Look who it is. Liking what you've done with the place, boss. Gangs certainly seem pleased with their new little kingdoms. Haven't seen people this revved up since last time someone spiked the water fountains. Never formally introduced myself. Name's Shank. And if you're standing here, well... I can't hear him. I suppose Gage figured you might be the one to finally get things back on track. I just want the power on. I don't give a fuck about the rest. How long did it take him to convince you it was time to move on the Commonwealth? Um, his suggestion, my decision. <laughs> Let's get one thing straight here. It may have been his suggestion, but it'll be my decision. I can see that. Well, regardless of the source. Idea is a good one. Giving the gang spots to call their own around the park, it bought you some goodwill. But providing them with their own domains, carved from the settlements of the Commonwealth, well, I can't think of a better way to solidify your place around here. Plus, do I have to make us all a pretty penny along the way? No, I don't want to. I if want the that power on. You, well, and that all you've got to do is say the word. And we can let the fun begin. Uh, don't want to hurt people. If I'm going to do this, I don't want to hurt people. <laughs> no fun in that. But look, you're the overboss. You decide you want to sweet talk the poor sods we're going to be dealing with instead of filling them full of lead. That's up to you. But I can't change the fact that you're gonna have to run some people out of their homes so we can give them to the gangs. No, it's not being meant. boss was gonna be easy. Now, you just say if this is something you're ready to move on. Nope. Let's discuss this later. Up to you, boss. I'm not going anywhere. How do we get the damn power on? Hang on, I'm googling this. Uh, Google. <laughs> right. 
is a locked door. Hang on. Right. Where is the Nuka World power plant? What? Uh, how to turn the power on in Nuka World? There we go. Turn, turning on the power in Nuka World requires the player to complete a few steps. First, each section of the park must be cleared as an outline mission for the Grand Tour, cleansing and claiming all five sections of the park. Speak to Gage will result in a relative rise in stability and not a very important choice. After speaking with Mackenzie Bridgman in the Nuka World USA market, the player can choose to engage in open season missions. This task is the player with hunting down the bosses of all three gangs, which will incidentally set each gang member in Nuka World against the player. After defeating the gang bosses and clearing the streets of enemies, the player can then progress to turn on the power. So I need to kill them all. Sh right? Right, I actually need to piss before I do this. I'll be back in a second. Just let him out of my room. <laughs> Went for a piss. And then came back to my room and he was like, eh, I'm gonna come back in. I was like, no, you can go downstairs for a bit. Oh, right, fuck that guy. Who do we need to go into the Nuka World Market? Right, and we need to find someone called. Uh, Mackenzie Bridgman. Mackin Mackenzie. Mackenzie. I'm sure there's Mackenzie. <laughs> Fuck Raiders. Right? Fuck them all. Always right, where's Mackenzie? Ride some of the attractions here. Even now. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. I fucking don't know. The traders here are no better than slaves. Stupid outdoor bastards. Head of stock. You ain't gonna bag him, right? Oh, uh. Aha! Hello, boss. Congratulations on taking out Coulter. I'm, uh, sure you'll do great. Why congratulate? Why would you congratulate me? It's not like you're free to go. Well, to be honest, I, I don't know you yet, boss. Sorry I'm so nervous. I didn't mean any disrespect, boss. I just don't know where I stand with you, and I, I don't want to end up pissing you off. That, and well, I'd be lying if I said we weren't all wondering how you plan to run the place. I mean, this not is Not with those damn collars on you. You can do anything you want. You can run Nuka World just like Coulter. Business as usual, or... You could... Um... Uh, well, you know, get rid of the Raiders if you don't exactly agree with how they're running the place. <laughs> I'm interested. Well, I admit, I didn't like being roped into this job in the first place. Then this might be your chance to make some changes around here. The gangs that call this place home are already at each other's throats. Now, you could risk your own neck and try to keep them from tearing each other apart... Or you could do the right thing and put them in the ground. And when okay. it's all said and done, you're still running this place from your fancy house on the mountain over there. Except now, you won't have to sleep with a gun under your pillow. Alright. Kill all I'd of have them? to kill all of them? No, of course not. If you're serious about this, then you'll have to take down the leaders of the gangs. That means putting a bullet into Nisha, Mason, Mags, and Mags's brother, William. Once you do that, 
the gangs will collapse and Nuka Town goes back to being a free trading post. I should, uh, probably stop talking about this out here. Just keep what I said in mind. Anyway, I'm the closest thing to a doctor around here. I treat everyone, raider, trader, or traveler alike. Got some medical supplies, too, if you're looking for those. Uh, all right. Patch me up, Doc. Of course. What seems to be the trouble? Kill me, rats. I think I soaked up some rads out there. All right, let's flush your system. <laughs> Came a long way to Done. This place. Now, was there anything else bothering you? No, I'm right, six. On your way, then. All right, time to hunt down some fucking bosses. I'm liking this. Let's go. And kick these fuckers out of my town. I'm the sheriff around here. I'm also the mayor. And the judge. And the jury. I'm also the executioner. In uh, 2062, the Nuka Girl rocket suit costume was released to retailers just in time for Halloween. The popularity was so overwhelming, the stores couldn't keep up with the demand. So, that guy thought he was alpha. He's gonna regret that. I'm coming for you, bitch. Hang on, I'm gonna give Piper some shit because I can't fucking walk. Piper, talk to me. Heads up. Right. Carry some of my junk. Just let me know. Cheers, love. Don't worry. Even cubs and pups are showing their I'll do them last. Out of respect. Go and do the other two. We'll start with the furthest away and we'll work our way back. Open season, motherfuckers. Damn, Nuka Cola song gonna die you're gonna die so hard you ain't even gonna know what killed you Beesh. I am hidden I am hidden from you from you none of you saw me do 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 Always keep your knife sharp. No one likes sloppy work. <laughs> Maybe I should have killed them with a knife. That'd have been amusing. Ooh, I need her to stand still so I can get a clean shot. Is there anyone else up here? I don't look it. Let's listen to Nisha's hollow tape. And 
mennä. Oh, no, it's just private entry. Sledge's dead wasn't as hard as I thought after he took me in as a kid, he raised me, trained me. I would have thought I'd at least hesitate, but he was the one that accidentally had my parents killed to begin with. And then he made the fatal mistake of leaving me behind. Bastard probably thought I was good as dead. But after all the times I stood by him, seeing that coward tuck tail and run erased any loyalty and respect I ever had for him. The best part was the look on his face when I came back. I still don't even know how I managed to escape, but with the amount of blood I had on me, I got a feeling it was pre wasn't pretty for my enemies after that. I realized just how much of what he said was pure bullshit. I gave him at least a month to listen to me, which feels merciful looking back, but it's done now. Sledge is dead along with any other asshole who didn't want to follow me. There's been a lot of change around here. I've been calling ourselves the Disciples. Uh, we follow the natural way of the world. Kill or be killed. Survival of the fittest. That kind of stuff. It's times like these. It's the only thing that makes sense. I watch these farmers much like my own parents. struggling uh, Struggle for some sense of civilization. Only to be crushed by super mutants, rad scorps, or, of course, raiders. There's nothing friendly about this world, and the only way to beat it is to be better. We've already managed to get a pretty good rep around here. Word spreads fast and apparently way further than I thought. I got some message from a guy named Gage. Says he wants to talk. Make a deal. Seems interesting. I almost felt guilty cutting the messenger's throat. So Gage had a proposition for us. We help him and other another guy named Coulter take a trade hub called Nuka World and make it our own so we're set for life. Drawbacks are we got to do this with two other gangs. And holy shit, you should see these guys. Plus they expect all of us to get along so no killing that they can prove. No one's going to be a fan of the no kill policy but I think it's doable with a don't get caught clause in there and admittedly we're running out of bodies to drain away anyway people are wising up and moving on if we get ourselves a major outpost and can stick to this one teeny tiny rule i think we could may have it made it's been almost a year at nuka world with no movement from coal to the only bonus was building the gauntlet it's at least mildly entertaining and keeps us help keeps us calm but it's time for a change. I can tell other leaders aren't happy. If Coulter doesn't make a move soon, both him and Gage are going to find themselves at the end, at the other end of my knife. Updated, apparently Mags, Mason and I aren't the only ones getting anxious. Gage stopped by, which I gotta admit, took some balls. He's got a plan to get rid of Coulter and get a new other boss to replace him. Also known as a plan to save his own ass. Might as well throw Coulter under the bus and let him take the fall. He knows he can't promote me, Mason or Mags, without all hell breaking loose. So he better know what he's doing. It's done. Gage pulled it off. Not only did he get some fresh blood in here to replace Coulter, but the fresh blood took out Coulter at the same time. It's too early to be impressed, though. There's no way to beat Coulter without Gage... Gage's help. So whether we got a shiny new overboss or another piece of shit dud remains to be seen. Okay. These assholes can try and fight me if they want. They're not going to win. I'm through. Watch list. Ruby. Rumors are saying Ruby's stealing from our own. Not sure what pisses, pisses me off more. <coughs> that she's either stealing from us or that she got caught. Either way, I don't have any proof besides Paige's claim, and Paige was probably too high on Jet to trust. Going to let this sit for now and see how things go. Um, Savoy found the remains of what looked like Josie's handiwork. I have one rule here, people. Why is it so damn hard to follow? When you hide a body, not only do you make sure it's hidden, you make sure it's really dead. Savoy said the pack guy was halfway back to Nuka Town when he found him. 
No solid proof that it was Josie's bedside... Oh, Josie, besides the fact that she and this guy got into it the other day. Samuel seems to forget who's in charge here and likes to question my decisions. He's smart enough to not challenge me directly, and I'm sure he knows if he tried to take me out. Savoy and Dixie would never follow him. He's trouble, though. Reminds me of Sledge, and he's new. So he doesn't know what went down back then, but if he keeps it up, he can learn the hard way, just like Sledge did. Uh, I'll watch for a different reason. Carrie has a bit of a conscience. Stopping, uh, stopped doing, uh, going on raids, barely leaves fist top. Something's up with her. She's either realised this isn't the life for her, or she's been compromised. And if I find out she's been, she's, she's turned traitor, I'm going to enjoy every moment I have tearing her apart. Oh, hang on. I didn't look at the reports. <clears throat> Remains of an old abandoned town south of Nuka World called Bradburton should be good for standard supplies, but nothing of real interest. Uh, Val said some crazies called, calling themselves herbologists have taken over the old calf by the giant fire hydrant. Got to admit, I am inclined to leave them be. Fanatics are always destructive in their own way. That could be good entertainment from a distance. Ooh, okay, we haven't looked at that. Dixie found an old ra roadside attraction called the Grandchester Mystery Mansion. She said it looks to be in decent condition, complete with an annoying ticket taking protectotron so it's worth looking into she had a few slaves in tow so didn't investigate further we'll need to put a team together to check it out at some point well, I'm glad I looked at that now I've got to kill the rest of these pricks oh I am it's you that's not getting out of this I didn't... Wow. I wasn't looking at my health. Jesus. That wanker hadn't have spotted me. We'd have been fine. Now I've got to fucking click on all those damn pages in a fucking computer again. Oh, fuck me. actually. <laughs> home sweet home failed.
Talk to Shank. What was the other one that I failed? All oh, right. Yeah. Go there, do you? Fucking Jesus Christ. Don't need to, mate. Right, let's look at our roller tape again. What was her name? I can't even remember what her name was. Oh, Nisha. How are you guys even fucking spotting me? I'm supposed to be basically invisible. Uh, you're not scared, are you? Nope. Just rather get my extra damage from being invisible. Two you fuckers left anyway. Mm. 
Come on. Here they come. Oh no. What the fuck are they doing? Alright, I'm fucking going to loot all the dead people then. Let's sort of loot what I can. I got fucking toast. There's no way I'm surviving that fall. Is there any loot in it? Oh yeah, I need to look through the computer again. <clears throat> That's it. Watch list, Ruby. Jose. Oh, is it Jose? got everything I need. These are obviously heads of people that pissed her off. Alright, do I actually have to kill these wankers now or not? Where are they? Hey, you up for a night run tomorrow? Depends. Who's leading? Dixie, of course. She's dead. Well, I'm about to find out. I don't know where the fuck they are. I don't mind killing them all. Aha! Free loot! Aha! Too low 
Sounds like a spoon going into ice. What's this? I think I'll keep you as my little souvenir. I had it out with that disciple chick again today, Anna. Tired of her always winning. She's got better aim, better comebacks, even packs a better punch. Well, not for long. Fuck these rules. I'm going after her. Then, when she's floating face down in the swamp pond. We'll see who's better. I can't wait to see. What the hell? How'd you get in here? What? A girl's got her ways. I'm just here because Anna's picking to help Anisha keep the peace between all us gangs. Me? Not so much. What the? That should keep you quiet till I get you back to Fizz Top. Oh, were you recording this just for little old me? You operators are such sweethearts. There's no escaping here. Really? There you go, Popo. Didn't realize you were damn. Yoink. Thanks, people. Appreciate all your shit. Raiders got raided. Don't fuck with the best. You end up like a damn rest. Six feet under. Or rather, not six feet under because I can't be asked to bury you. Wee. <clears throat> right, Popo. I see all these wankers. Or maybe it's not. Hang on. Are you guys dead? You're not. Hey there. Please, let me go. How do I let you go? Don't sit down for fuck's sake. How do I let him free? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, benches are so annoying. Aha, here we go. The rule. Uh, just a reminder, we have one rule at, here at Nuka World. You kill someone from another the gang, don't get caught. If I see evidence of anyone here violating this rule, I'll take care of you personally. Uh, so we just got ourselves a new overboss. One R1 rule still applies. Anyone has a problem, they can take it up with me. Anyone interested in the night raid, meet up at the monorail station at midnight. Anyone bored as shit can meet up at the main gates at dusk. Heard there's a caravan passing nearby, gonna find some live ones to run the gauntlet. Whatever supplies they got, I'm just gonna... I'm just icing on the cake. Uh, got a hand cream for blood, need to kick back and let loose Dixie's monthly slice and dice his back. So sharpen those knives and ditch those chems because it's time to feed the one addiction that we all share. Whoever pissed in my helmet, you're dead. That's some real pack level shit right there. I left a little surprise for you in the usual spot. Thought you could put it to good use against a certain asshole. Got to head out to the take care of some business. But I'll be back in a few days. Figured out, uh, figured you wouldn't want to wait. Uh, looking for someone to upgrade my knife because I don't know jack about metal. I can repay in trade, caps, whatever. Hit me up if you're down. Jokers need not respond. 
Uh, don't trust Ruby. She's a backstabbing bitch that needs to be dealt with. I caught her stealing couch from her personal stash and she had the balls to deny it. Luckily, she can't read, so she doesn't know what she has coming. She doesn't deserve to be one of us. Okay. Don't give a fuck about that, mate. Well, there seems to be no way to free those prisoners. At least not that I can see. These guys are fucking weird. They've just got skulls hanging around. Like, what the fuck? Bloody weirdos. They're all serial killers, clearly. Not that I'm any better. I've killed more people than anyone in the Commonwealth, clearly. Don't worry about me, Piper. I'm all good. Well, I guess we'll just leave these guys here. I can't help them. Alright, let's bounce. Hopefully no one outside wants to fight me. Sometime today would be fucking lovely. She kind of looks like a uh, like a primitive version of Cyclops from X Men. Sometime today would be a lovely game if you don't mind. Cheers, Tom, for letting me know that I've got a notification from uh, one of my games. Some this is gonna be fun. No, no. Well, I've just caused war here, clearly. Oh, the operators are fighting me as well now. Well, now there's a war going on in Nuka World. Of course you lost one. Fuck is going on. I hit that fucker on the face like six times. Oh, I can hear gunfire, so I'm guessing there's a whole war going on out here. Free shit! Get your free shit here! I guess you're supposed to kill them when they're asleep rather than the way I did it. <laughs> well, he's an enemy now. What was that? He's dead. Oh, 
I'll just wipe out all the raiders. It's fine by me. Sorry, dude. But I'm really not that sorry. I'm not too fussed. They're all fucking raiders. And great if it was night time. Well, at least I'm getting some more XP. I fucking need it. Jesus. You're a traitor. You're on my side. Gunfire coming from this way. Who is fighting? Hmm. Is it going night time yet? Actually, it is. I'm going to be fucking invisible pretty much in a minute. <sighs> Who are they fighting? They're fighting one another. They are. Quick, get out of there, love. Found you. I'm game. <laughs> Don't even think about it. <laughs> that woman's fucking hilarious. Finished killing the last of them. Happy hunting! You, Missy, are fucking amusing. I killed all of the assholes. Oh, nearly 200 stimpacks. I think they're fighting the traders. There's the other wanker. Right, let's go and deal with these wankers. Remove all the raiders from existence. I'm gonna have to change the episode name to War on the Raiders. Something out there. <coughs> if we're gonna dance, yeah. let's dance. Uh. Uh. There you are. Um, 
I would love to know what the fuck that was. Kill those wankers, I'm gonna launch me nuke grenade in the other room. That is fucking bullshit. What the fuck weapon is that? Like a cluster bomb or some shit. It just fucking insta kills you. Something out there. Right, that's it. Where is it? Fuck it, let's take this fight outside. <laughs> I'm not getting caught in a corner and getting blown up again. Killed a few of them. Let's back down a bit. Bring these wankers outside where it's fair ground and I can fucking just hit them. Well, I've killed the ones in the lobby now, so if we wait a minute, they should just fuck off even if they don't follow me. They shouldn't be waiting in the, uh, the lobby like they were, so I should get the stealth bonus. Which is really what I wanted. Oh, I should have just killed the other bitch with a stealth kill. I should have just waited until she'd gone to sleep. And just Mr. Sandmanded her. Why are you taking so long to load? Alright, pull it down the street quick. No one's following me? That's surprising. Alright, I'm gonna wait for an hour. Let's make it two, just to be careful. Right, time to go back in. Gun drop. Grenade ready. Shouldn't be anyone in the lobby now. Portion. Okay, I can deal with that. There must have been a roach or something. Okay. Where's two of the wankers? Right, but let's stay as hidden as we can. Who's shooting? And at what? Oh, so close. I 
There's another wanker down. Hey, something's out there. They're back! Here you go, Mag. Have a grenade. Blue, we're not alone here. Sleep tight. Crap, my leg. Oh, I want to be in your shoes. Stupid raiders. Of course it did. Made your own grave. Have I? Because I just killed everyone in your family. One of them, pieces of one of them landed in the bin. I think he's the only one left. What was that? Hey! They're here! What else you got? Bitch. Where did sister die to? Is this her? Lizzie, that was it. She, did she leave us a note? Lizzie L. She didn't. Well, let's stay uh, crouched just in case there's a few more of these wankers lying about. Oh, this is her sister, Mags. That was it. Better in our hands anyway. Nope, didn't leave us anything. Oh, that music is awful. Can't believe how little my gun was doing damage wise to these people. You did. Yoink. Oh, but 200 stim packs. Hell yeah. I did it, guys. That was my lifelong goal of Fallout 4. Uh, thank you. No, I'm joking. <laughs> no. I came in to steal their shit, lady on the radio. Oh, nothing. Yoink. Eh. 
Oh je. Du, 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 du. Uh, all of that. Where's my weight at now? Fucking hell, I'm already higher weight than I was the last time I went home. Just from killing raiders and taking their shit. You're dead. Anyone else that's dead? Oh yeah, this guy. Oh fucking it's her head landed on the table. Um What is this strip club? Oh no, it was a like a proper sit in club where you listen to singing while eating. Oh, I'll take those tickets. Yoink. Well, that's the operators dealt with. Uh, hey, I know you're operator and I'm pack, but I that ain't mean we can't be friendly or whatever. I saw the way you were looking at me. I'm open for crossing enemy lines, if you know what I mean. Meet me in the hub after sundown. I know a place we can go. That good-looking guy with the blue hair. <laughs> uh, very funny. I thought we had something going there. You ops are all the same. Screw you. If I ever see you again, I'll slap a collar on you. We'll see how you like that. Pissed off guy with a blue hair. <laughs> Here's Billy Holiday bringing us owned. Easy living. Ooh, computer. That's a good title. I just may steal that from my uh, Phantom of the Nuka. The Phantom, who lives in the catacombs beneath the bottling plant, longs to find a drink that can satisfy his 300 year old thirst. Due to his horrific appearance and his self imposed estrangement from society, his. Is that a fucking. Oh, that's no, part of the computer. Um, his hopes of getting his hands on Nuka Cola seems impossible until the plant hires a beautiful Christine. The Phantom is in, enraptured by Christine and hatches a scheme that he hopes to unite the two of them together to quench his thirst for Nuka Cola before his body dries up and withers away. Uh, the best little nook house. Yeah, sure, whatever. Let's just see if we can get any missions out of these. This isn't really, isn't even fucking. Nope. Do 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 it's easy living, it's easy to live. Maggie, it's your mother. I want you to know, your father and I, we take no pleasure in this decision. But at this point, we don't have a choice. You and Bill have dragged the black name through the muck for the last time. What they say you do, and that Wyeth girl did to those classmates of yours, True or not, defending you both again and again. It's gotten to the point we can barely do business in this town anymore. You two have cost us so much. And are you repentant? Are you sorry? Of course not. 
Well, we are through defending. Sweet. Sweet. All right, let's listen to the next one. Mother, it's Max. Thank you so much for your tape. It kept William, Lizzie, and I very entertained during our time in the holding cell. We found the part about refusing us our inheritance particularly amusing. Because that money is ours. Years we spent under your thumb, trying to be the perfect little dolls you always wanted. Both have the scars to prove it. So if you think we didn't earn every cap that's due to us, then you're even dumber than I thought. We're coming for those caps. And there's nothing you can do to stop us. Takes the treasure souvenirs from a victim, sure someone meddling with her toys might be safe. able to get her it's to do secure. something rash should need the need to rise. Granted, her currently position in niche is probably to support the girl's vanity, much like less likely to turn on her boss if she thinks she's respected. Thanks to that, she does seem to honor Nietzsche's authority. Doesn't appear to have plans to claim leadership for herself. Best of all Best for all of us. Sorry. Uh, enforcer, fiercely loyal, likely to only reason the man's been given place of prominence among their little coven. Had one of our girls attempt to seduce him, but if we might be able to sway him in, as a contact, but no, to no avail. Had one of the boys tried two similar results. Suspect he's probably working f for or with the only person he has eyes for. What do you explain the loyalty? Current Pack Alpha displaced his two predecessors by tarring and feathering them, sending them out into the waste. Lax state members can only shame one another, never kill. Both former Alphas were never heard from again after being given the boot. Acquiring proof of their deaths could be useful leverage. We'll send out a search party, see what they turn up. Otherwise, man's more nuisance than threat, like the rest of the pack. One half of the alleged masterminds behind the Nuka World plan clearly as much of a rube as the rest of us. It does seem like he honestly believed in Coulter now, though. Just seems worried he's going to share Coulter's fate if things don't get back on track. Not wrong. Undoubtedly moved on this new overboss to protect his own neck. However, man genuinely does appear to believe that Nuka World can be used to make us all rich, so does have some value. No one's problem anymore. <laughs> yep, that's because he's dead. Right, where's this storeroom I was promised? We've got a key to it. If it does, if it's a little bit peculiar. Mm-hmm. And then kneeling down on my knees. Saying, darling, please marry me. Where the fuck is it? I want it. Hang on to it. For it's a man. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck's going on? Nothing useful. Down, baby, lay the pistol down. Pistol back in mama. Oh, this room. Was this the room? Probably. Aha! Lay the pistol down. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. do every night, being I woo you every day. I'll be a regular mama and I'll put that gun away. There we go. So this will be test eight of the persuasion formula. Our subject here. What'd you say your name was again? Fuck you, Lizzie. When my crew yes. finds out about this, they're gonna wear your skin. Yes. 
Okay, we're just gonna call you Eight. Eight, would you please stop talking? Go to hell. As you can see, Eight is currently not receptive to my suggestions. Now, deploying the formula. Uh, what? What the- Hey! Hey, yourself. Eight, how do you feel right now? Fine. Good, I guess. Excellent. Now, Eight, I'm going to untie your arm. Okay. Now, Eight, I want you to hit yourself. Hit myself? Please. Ah! Again, please. Harder this time. Ah! That's perfect. Thank you, Eight. You can stop now. Thank you. You're welcome. Eight, I'm going to untie you. Now, if you wouldn't mind... Eight! <laughs> what are you... <sighs> are you an idiot? Did you really think that shit would work? I'm gonna eat your... <sighs> Thank you, William. I'm... I'm going to need a minute before you bring in number nine. Uh, some goals and somebody can be sure. Uh, decided it was time to run a real test of the formula in, uh, I'd order Annette to do a task outside the parlour, unsupervised, give her the chance to run and see if she'd actually return. First step was, of course, getting her in a state where she'd want to run. After a few days of pain, I gave her a dose and asked her to collect some ingredients for me from the market. All by herself, almost, William was watching from the rooftop just in case she did decide to run. And so we sat a minute, two minutes, three minutes, uh, three, waiting in the parlour with Mags. I could see the disapproval frown start to edge in at the corners of her mouth. But five minutes later, who comes limping back into the parlour? Lovely, Annette. Arms full of exactly what I asked, even set a few new duration record for a single dose of the formula. Now, unfortunately, the wound she'd sustained during our prep ended up getting the best of her not long after, but still, we all knew a success. We all knew a success when we saw one. <coughs> really can't be asked to read these. They were testing drugs on people. This batch had apparently gone bad without me realising it, got the bruises to show for it. Max wanted to see it might be able to put a formula. The local Brahmin trains favor. Da, 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 da. Okay. Nine. Finally, another success. William brought me in another farmer who responded much the same as Annette did. A th thread to follow, it would seem. Uh, we have our results. Caravans, no market. Caravans, no. Markets, no. But settlements, it would appear, are what this formula was made for. Maybe uh, it's. Ex the exhaustion brought on by manual labour, the bad water, but something about that environment, and that's wretched environment, appears to favour the gas. Decided to track my way back to, te to se test subject 9's little dirt pit and see what I could get to happen when I deployed the gas. Before I knew it, I had some feeding me their winter stores, handing over whatever caps they had, and only convincing them that, that them, their Brahmin style was better in my hands off they shuffled sad but unable to refuse and the look on their face is truly something to behold do, 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 six nine what do you know do, 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 Next up, the, the rest of these wankers. Oh. One group left. It's 
time for me to take control of the pack by offing their alpha. As soon as the game wants to fucking load. Thanks, game. Appreciate it. Okay, you're a friendly. Yet another breaking story here in Diamond City, folks. I'll bring you up to speed. <laughs> Man, Diamond City's own Nick Valentine is reportedly yes, has to wait. Circumstances surrounding former residents of the West Ooh, Stand. I think there's someone. <laughs> How the fuck did he spot me? Hasn't been seen. Now it seems. The whole story may have been fabricated. It's unclear at this time if the board is being held against its will. Authorities have so far refused to come. Oh, you want to come through? You've got to come through one of these doors. Should you happen to spot the man in Don't hesitate to get word to Nick Valentine. Keep that dial to Diamond City Radio for updates on this breaking story. Where are you? Now here's one that anyone know can relate. It's all over. Hope you made your peace. Just give up now. How is Shank so overpowered? What the fuck? Do you know what? I'm, I'm having me level up. You can wait a minute. Right, where'd he go? There he is. Oh, no, that's just a veteran. Where did Shank him. go? Oh, I'll let Piper have a fight with him. Blue, come on. Carry something oh, he's be on there as well. Oh, you're still here? Get down. You're all bravado and no Good night, Shank, you wanker. It's all over but the crying. Nobody's crying but you. It's all over but the crying. Forget about so much I care for you. It's all over, but the dreaming over me. It's all over, but the grind can get. You're friendly. I need to be going this way. <laughs> Where'd they lead it? Their outside defense go. The doors and the barroom floor. Obviously, the man who had the pewdest personality. 
I'm about to get jumped. This is a very open entrance. Personality. The Romeo seen Juliet appear in period during Juno. What? The It's fine, they're just dope. Ooh, let's not play with whoever's throwing those. Will you just fucking die, Mason, you wanker? Thank you, I'm now the Alpha. Fuck off, you little bastard. I've killed your leader, I'm the Alpha. Now fucking sit down, you baited bitches. Excuse me, I've taken the right of alpha by combat. Right of combat is law. You guys are breaking the law right now. The law of the animal world. Fuck off. <laughs> Wanker. Anything goes. <laughs> that damn gazelle go. Oh, it's there. Oh, shit. I just remember. I left the bear cage open. Or whatever the fuck it was. Yes. Can't keep you out. Obviously not. Ooh. I'm gonna have to go in there, aren't I? Anything knows. Well I need to go in there. Oh fuck it, I'll go in there now, I'm over it. We like today. We like today. I'm running out of ammo, Jesus. I fucking chewed through ammo killing these fuckers. <laughs> what the fuck? That guy is alive and I can't even put it out of its misery. That's just cruel. What 
Wolves do not let their prey suffer. They kill them quickly so that they can't get away. That's just the way it is. You guys are fake wolves and you're giving them a bad name, so I'm putting you all down. That was anything goes by Cole Porter. Plus I want to put the power back on and it seems the only way I can do that without handing over some of my settlement to these wankers was to fucking kill you all. Which, I'd rather do that anyway. <clears throat> I fucking hate raiders. I lulled them into a false sense of security and now I'm picking them off. Some bold claims by our intrepid reporter. I wouldn't worry too much about the synths. The mayor's office has, of course, issued a statement denying the validity of the article, saying all is well in Diamond City. The mayor is a gorilla. Oh, it's an enemy. I have to kill it. Good to know, I guess. Okay, now. Here we go. But between you and me, listen, I'm going to keep Don't let me do. Oh, thank fuck. I don't have to kill the cat. Well, never a dull You're free now, Kitty. Do as you please. Now let's hear from Bob Crosby. Happy times. Wanker. This is a I'm sorry, Mr. Gorilla. It reminds me that life... I wouldn't have killed you if I didn't have to. <laughs> and now I'm alpha, motherfuckers. Not that anyone's left alive, apart from you, Piper. I was alpha anyway. Just had to put this little bitch in his place trying to tell me he's alpha. Who do you think I am? Some sort of pleb. Bitch. That's just cruel. They make a fucking chair out of a gorilla and have a gorilla in a cage just across to look at it. How is that gorilla even loyal to them? Alright, let's go and check out the inside of this fucking gaff, I reckon. Do, 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 do. Probably should have been crouched. <laughs> Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> What we got? Five, happy, happy ho, 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 ho. I need that guy to go to bed. Yo, psst. hold. Where to? Wait there. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Shoot. Alive one, boys. Don't pin a wolf in a corner, he will fucking bite you. Working every day and I'm getting my feet. Hope you're in the way, love. People 
Money, money, honey, the kind of gold. I can carry money, something. money, honey, rock and roll. Then the man and the love like pain. I have a rocking good time and throw it all away. Didn't even feel it. Wouldn't want to be in your hands. I'll be here when you want to come out and play again. Have a rocky good time and throw it over the Oh, you're a captive. Hey, and the long Cadillac. Yep. I'll be good, Piper. No, 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 ain't come back. Let's do 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 Well, I don't know what I've been told. Uranium ore is worth more than gold. I bought me a Jeep. And I can sleep. Uranium fever is gonna get me down. Uranium fever is spreading all around. Well, I got a counter in my hand. I'm gonna take me some government land. Oh, I thought it was gonna be enormous ego. Infested? Said he knowed. It headed down the road. Garrison. Morpheus. Oh, come on. Conquerors. Uranium fever spreading all around. Accident. Destruct. There we go. Uh, she lets her operators off the leash too often. Some of mine got gone missing. I'm sure they're the reason. Don't mind all that much. Coals the pack of weaklings and morons. But if it don't stop soon, I'll need to start letting mine off their leashes too. I got ugly. Do my back, little girl of straight. I don't know what, uh, how she keeps her crazies in line and what's with all the masks. I mean, yeah, my guys got them too, but they take them off once in a while. I ain't never seen a disciple without something covering their face. Well, not a live one anyway. Uh, Gage is running out of time. If he does, don't address this Coulter situation, one of us is going to do it for him. And it's likely going to be me. I wouldn't mind running this place. Max, Nisha and their crew might ha need to have an accident. Don't think they'd like taking orders from me. I need to think of something clever to... All these guys are going to pin in on me. Dead, goodbye, ain't going to miss you. Not sure yet, going to give it a chance and see what shakes out. Best step up to bat or there's gonna be a beat down i can't believe all it took was a damn squirt gun and cotter went down like prey clever that was uranium fever by bored i think i'm done with this stupid thing why did i even start typing this stuff into this dumbass machine now i need to figure out how to delete everything wait i got an idea Good news is something uh, congratulations if you're reading this come see terminal. me i got something really special planned so for I anyone able to hack my terminal it's to die for. If you were one of the folks worrying <laughs> in hushed tones about the whereabouts of Diamond City's most effective detective, you can rest easy. Do, 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 Nick do, do, Valentine do. is back in town and seems to has been for months. For Travis. While details about what happened to him are scarce, I for one am just glad he's back. And he was peace. held hostage by a and group of any more thugs. Share, pretty much. First here on Diamond City Radio. 
Can't get enough of Butcher Pete. Lucky for you, Roy Brown wrote a second song about him. Trail. Do more. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. He keeps hacking and whacking and smacking. Keep whack, whack, chopping that meat. Oh, I accidentally killed one of these guys. My bad. Sorry, guys. Them, them meat. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. Hey. Yeah. Yes. You're free. You can leave. Right. Let's just grab up the rest of this damn loot and leave. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. He keeps hacking and whacking and smacking. Keeps hacking and whacking and smacking. He's hack, whack, chopping that meat. Boink. I think I've killed everyone. He's hacking and whacking and smacking. Or at least I think so. Oh, no, I don't care about that. Let me out. Oh, fuck was that? Why is stream so far behind? Hang on, what was that? Buzz's note, okay. Back to B. Uh, right. Keep this to yourself. Found one of them Brotherhood of Steel outpost. Whole place was torn to hell. Bodies and ghoul corpses everywhere. Found a working power armor suit just sitting in there. All we need to do is find one of them glowy battery things. Think I know where I can find one. I'm going to need help. You in? Buzz. Well, that was that. Oh, Buzz's apology. I know you said you ain't never going to talk to me again, but just read this, okay? I was going to know... How was I going to know they were coming back? I thought they were all dead. I'm really sorry about your finger. I am. I only laughed because what else was I going to do? I laugh when I don't know what to do, okay? Uh, look, I bet you don't even realise you lost it. I'm going to go back and sneak in and look for it. I'm also going to nab that power armour if I can. Lies and tears And will shine lose the blues in their and I think of you, another power starts into each life. Some rain must fall, but too much is falling in mine. And into each life, some rain must fall. Is that a dead Yaogwai? No, it is very much alive. And apparently not angry at me. Ooh! No, still not angry at me. Into each life, some rain must fall. 
to sneak around that fucker. <laughs> oh, they got a chem bench. Piper, are you fucking mad, love? Don't even do it! Remember that operator I gave a nose job? Well, she came around with some pals, tried to get a jump on me. Now I got three dead ops in that dumpster, the one where we stashed those chems. Didn't mean to kill them, but when it's three to one, you gotta go hard. Ugh, they're starting to smell. Uh. Get a crew, a couple hacksaws, and some shovels. Meet me back there tonight. And for fuck's sake, erase this tape. <laughs> Not what I meant to do at all. Stand up. <laughs> worry, worry. Worry, worry, I'm passing me by. Worry, 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 I'm so painfully shy. Robbed. Worry, 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 woe is me. Don't get yourself collared or worse, get even. Uh, but you've got to admit, giant wads of bubblegum shot out of makeshift cannons was pretty good. They must have been chewing that for weeks, but we can do better. I found a couple boxes of wonder glue and cherry bombs on my last run. Okay. I keep worrying right along. I find I didn't worry again. I things can go wrong. The element is a bad. Worry, 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 I'm a piece in the mind. I don't know who was a daddy. I'm an old Jew. My name is Harry. Woe is me. And that looks like a note. It is. Uh, he's dead. I don't care what happens to me. I'm killing that asshole. Had to shave all the hair off my body, and I'm still finding that shit wedged in places I never knew I had. Just looking at a pack of like gum pisses me off. Rob. While their motivations aren't entirely clear, about what they're up to. Probably. I think it's safe to say there was some tech they wanted. Heavy, and shocking, sharp, painted rocket them. hammer. I know I wouldn't want to Ooh. be in their way. The reports go on to say they made it out in one piece, presumably with whatever they were after. Robbed. Maybe now they'll be moving on to greener pastures. Let's get back to the music. Uh, well, I think we've now, looted the fuck Connie out of this place. Last with 
Yep, seems like it. <laughs> like to ride on my rock at 69. I would like to ride in my rock at 69. Ha! Found it's gonna be your last mistake! Oh, you. I wonder if this is normal for other journeys. I don't think you are. Ours now. Well, where is he? Hey Mason. I'm the alpha now, bitch. Suck on these nuts. And I didn't gotta be so satisfied. Oh shit, I never checked to see how much weight I'm carrying now. 5,597. Madness. Oh, hello to whoever's watching. I don't know who it is. Kid69. Well, that's how much weight you get from killing every single prick in this place. Well, every single prick that I've found so far. That is a raider. Not the traders. I think I have to take like 180 off of that weight. Because that's how much I was carrying to start with. Well, scratch that. There's more stuff to be collected. stand and you didn't stand very long did you I want your shit five thousand eight hundred and fifteen hey love Mackenzie boss I I can't believe it you killed the Raiders all of them I have to ask why to set you free <laughs> Raid is a scum. You and the other traitors were being treated like slaves. I had to put an end to it. Well, you certainly did that. I've thought about this day for a long time. Dreamed about it, really. Though I never thought I'd see that dream come true. Now that it has, I'm left with a question that I don't know the answer to. What happens next? Uh, what do you want? What do you want to happen? I think we should keep this place going, like the way it used to be. Only now, we can use the money we bring in to make our lives better. Before you go, there's one last thing I need to say. Thank you. Sincerely. You're welcome. From all of us. Thank you. Wherever the road takes you, know that you'll always be welcomed back here in Nuka World. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to figure out a way to safely remove these collars. Dr. Bridgman. How are you feeling? 
I can take care of any sickness or injuries you might have. Actually, I wanted to be your first customer. I need some supplies, Doctor. Of course. Here's my current stock. Uh, what can I buy from you? Um, thousand caps seems reasonable. Nine hundred ninety-nine. Whoop whoop. Right. How do I get the power back on? Uh, to play with hunting down the boss of all three gangs eventually every set every day against a player after defeating all gang bosses and clearing the streets of an enemy's player can progress to turning on the power alternatively by helping raiders and conquering three commonwealth settlements the player can trigger a gang uprising after putting down the uprising the player can then continue the steps below uh, once the prerequisite above are met head to the northwest section of nuka world map the road looping north leads to a power plant. Northwest. Hmm. This isn't north. Oh, I suppose this is the right place. Over here. So I need to go there. Alright. And then I can go and do the thing that I want to do. Right. Can we fast travel from here? So it would be much quicker if we fast travel to here. I'll tell you what, once we've loaded in, I'm going to leave it there for tonight because I didn't realise it was 12 minutes to midnight. <laughs> We'll go and turn the power back on tomorrow. Actually, shall we go and... We'll get to the power plant, then we'll end. Uh, which way was out? The last outbound tram to the Nuka World Transit Center will be leaving the park promptly at 11.55 p.m. This way? Thank you. Here we go. Right, I need to loop round and go around the outside. I need to go that way. <laughs> Robbed. Do 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 do. It's gonna take me a while to get over there due to the fact of I keep running out of AP. What the fuck is going on over here? There was Super Mutant too. Oh, I've got to clear out the areas again because there's people in them that I let them have the areas. Folks, I'd, I'd like to take a moment for something a little more. Uh, 
As I'm sure you know all I'll have to do that tomorrow as well then. I've decided to change how I look at things. How I live my life. Can I'd like you to see take that? this opportunity to thank the vault dweller for lending me a hand. I do, really do, do, do. appreciate it. Do, 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 All right. Do, 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 do. That's enough sentiment. What's that for? Wait, I didn't see anyone in those areas, actually. Now that I say about it, talk about it, there weren't anyone in where I just was inside. Mm. Watch out, watch out. There's a two legged animal running about. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> goes around to the bar. Well. I need to buy some more ammo. I'm gonna have to go around my villages at some point when I get back to the Commonwealth and just go and buy a fuck ton of ammo. Hey, found them and they do not look friendly. Doing one piece. Your habits are a little bit peculiar. Power plant. What's that weird ass noise? Personality and all the books and all the merry books and all the love and the bravery and then the world undeveloped personality. Nah, they never just want to talk. You held your own. Embryo in being on Jupiter in Juno. What the fuck is that flashing for? Mountains and the mountains, see to see. The unit of the universe, personality. Sweet. 
Personality. <laughs> that noise is horrible. Oh my fucking god. You are fat. Fuck off. Right, fuck you all, I'm going in. Clearly, this is going to be a feral ghoul area, so... <laughs> Gotta be careful. Minding my business. It's going flash bam, and look at them. Ingen and sunshine. Hell, it goes in. Looks like you're about ready to topple over. I'm looking at the timber. Well, considering I'm carrying 6,195 out of 350, I think I'm doing pretty well, Piper. Good night, long. And in my business, me in the air, then helicopters and colored sky. Not falling for that, you prick. Flash, bam, alakazam, colored purple stripe. Da -da -da. Flash, bam, alakazam, and goodbye. Nuka World Power Plant, hails to the year. I wanted to stealth kill the fucker. Right, well this is the way in, obviously. Right, well we'll end here for today. Put my gun away. And... Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it. If you don't, as per usual. And I will catch you tomorrow at 8.30pm GMT. Cheers and adios. Bye guys. Bye, 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 bye. Cheers for the likes, by the way.